Okay, um, since I'm staying at her mom's house, her brother works on cars, uh, so you know. But uh, since I'm staying at her mom's house uh, right now until we get her house cleaned out, um, if you haven't known, uh, her grandmother had died, uh, and uh, she's just now starting to clean that house out since she took care of her. But uh, I thought I would uh, cut the grass for her uh, her mom since I'm staying here. So naturally I got Tasha out there to uh, to cut the grass. No, well I didn't want to ride anybody's riding lawnmower. So uh, I don't like to mess somebody's riding lawnmower up. I'm really weird about doing that. Uh, might want to raise the deck up because her mom doesn't want to see dirt. She just told me about this mower. This mower, I was going to push around everything, but that doesn't have a filter on it, and I'm not going to run any line mower without a filter, and it's not even cranking up yet. Uh, but I was going to at least try to get it cranked up without the filter, uh, but I will not cut grass without it. It'll mess your engine up. Uh, so I'm going to tell her to raise that deck before she goes too much further, and um, I will be back in a little bit. Hey, while she's cutting grass, I might jump on the mower in a minute. I'm going to walk the yard. No, not prison, but I'm going to walk the yard and uh, make sure there's no sticks or uh, any big debris in there that I can run over. Uh, like I said, I don't like to use other people's riding lawn mowers. I really don't like to use pushing mowers, but the riding lawn mowers are a little more expensive if you if you bust that crankcase, uh, the crankshaft on there. Not the crankcase, but the crankshaft, because when you hit something really hard that doesn't move, yes, or you can warp it too. So I'm not a fan of that, uh, but uh, huh? Yeah. Other than that, it was a nice day today. Um, so we just thought we'd be out here, um, take care of the yard a little bit, uh, put a little bit less stress on her mom. Um, I know her mom's working at, at Nike right now, uh, so that's a, a good thing. Uh, she was out of work just for a little while, uh, and uh, I'm glad she did get that job. It's a really nice job. They're paying her actually 20% more for working during the corona. So uh, I didn't know Essential was have Nikes in the house. Like Essential, you have to have Nikes. Uh, but man, she is doing a great job on that yard. Maybe I'll let her do the whole thing. I mean, I, I do like doing yard work. Uh, I, uh, before I did just regular construction, I did a lot of landscaping. I did retainer walls, uh, koi ponds. I did a lot of stuff. So I really like being in the yard the best. Uh, so if I cut grass, I get paid to do something I like to do. Uh, I did uh, cut trees, uh, did a lot of stuff, guys, that you really, really don't know. Um, I just stopped doing painting and stuff at the last when you saw me. I did painting before all my paint stuff got burned up. Uh, but I wouldn't mind getting paint brushes and stuff, still doing that. Uh, <clears throat> but maybe I'll start back doing landscaping. Give me a trailer and start cutting grass in the, in the summertime. Since uh, the, the summer times here, the spring, summer, fall, last, the, the season for cutting grass is a lot longer uh, than it is in St. Louis. Uh, Texas, you can cut grass about all year round. Uh, but this region um, has a really low frost. Uh, it doesn't get that cold. So it's going to be good for gardening, really good for gardening. Uh, and yes, folks, this right here, I got donated. Uh, people uh, yelling at me for wearing the shirt or, or applauding me for wearing this shirt. I don't do sports, guys. This is just a, a work shirt, outside shirt. It matches my shoes type shirt. Um, I'm not, I just don't get it. When people don't even know you, they walk up to you and say, F the Cowboys, F you. Like, you don't even know me, guy. I could be a pastor or a priest, deacon. <laughs> no, but you don't know. You know, you just come up to somebody, Neanderthal, freaking, what is wrong with you people? Testosterone. You know, the guy's like 10 pounds soaking wet. Boy, let's say 100, soaking wet, and they're screaming at the TV about these 300 pound guys, and they're like, I would run through the middle. You should run through the middle. That's what she said. No, but that's what they say. You know, little, little scrawny guys, like, oh, you don't know what you do. Guy, you get out there and do it. You f you're letting somebody else fight your battles. That's what it is. When people yell at me for, oh, you ate slow. You ate that pizza slow. So I comment back, oh, I checked your channel out. Looks like you eat slower than me, so that makes you even worse. Or like uh, when Molly beats me, because she's the number one eater of the world, independent eater of the world. When Molly beats me eating, they go, oh, you got beat by a girl. So I comment back, you get beat by a guy that gets beat by a girl. It's even worse. 
She, she, she wants me to go to work. Okay, I'll talk to you later. I'm in trouble. Well, I got it to working. Um, now it's cam it's camera shy, guys. Stage fright. Okay, I'm not gonna run it without a filter, but I made sure I got that that running. Um, so I'm glad I got that taken care of. Uh, just uh, get a filter so the air doesn't get in the intake too too much and cut it off. Uh, I don't act like I know too much about anything because then everybody wants you to fix stuff. But uh, this is worth fixing um, since uh, her mom's helping me out. So I don't mind doing doing that for her. So hopefully she don't tell nobody I fixed lawnmowers because I forgot I'm gonna have Alzheimer's. No, but uh, it's just the air. It's all about air, spark, and gas. It's those three things if you really want to get into fixing stuff that's the three things you got to worry about you got to have a good mixture of that like a tornadic uh a mixture of that you got to have the precise to get the the right outcome that's what she said so okay let me get her reaction of cutting the neighbor's lawn okay what i did was uh unscrew this eight millimeter uh screw took this off there's a filter behind there it's supposed to be there's no filter behind there so it's getting too much air intake <clears throat> so i i'm not going to worry like i said i'm not going to worry about uh using this lawnmower because i'm going to get dust into the uh the engine because uh, that's bad uh the other thing is this right here let me get a light on here inside of here if you can see see that but uh it's rusted up in there that's what she said but i did get a uh see the silver just there I, I got a screw to uh to grind that out like to to scrape all the rust to some of the rust out what i'm, I'm gonna get a metal brush to, to put in there you could use coca-cola and make sure it's dry if you're done but you can use coca-cola to uh to, to get that uh, cleaned out but you want to use some kind of rust abrasive uh material to get that off and then it goes to the spark plug. If you, sometimes you can check this uh, for a gap, let somebody else start it, and just don't don't try to don't shock yourself. But it'll be a, you'll see the spark uh, if it's getting a spark to it. Uh, <clears throat> other than that, um, there is one other item on here. It's up on it's right here. I don't know if you can see it, but it's a, a half inch bolt in there that you can uh, take off and there's it sometimes just this this uh, uh gets water inside there so you want to dump that out to get all the water out uh, the big thing i want to tell you guys i'm not a lot more two engine cycle mechanic uh no doubt about that uh i'm a, a f uh, professional preventive fluid specialist uh that's what i call myself when i work to jiffy loop it, it sounds more uh uh, important well valvoline as well i worked for valvoline and jiffy lube but uh, i made that up with valvoline uh, it just sounds like a more important job uh but what the heck was i just talking about guys the uh must have been a lie oh the gas sometimes these have a gas valve like on my tiller you shut the gas off and then you let the engine run until all the uh, gas is out the lines so it doesn't stay in there and eat away at the gaskets. Um, if you don't have that, I usually pour all the gas out of the mower at the end of the year, start it up and, and, and tie it. I don't recommend this, guys. I'm just saying what I would do. I tie this off and just let it, let it sit there, not unsupervised. You want to sit there and watch it so no little kid gets under there and wants to play G.I. Joe helicopters and think that's a helicopter under there. But uh, 
let the gas run out and then store it for the winter. You can put that, that heat in there. Uh, they got something you can put in your gas so it doesn't, so the water uh, uh, doesn't uh, sit in there. Hey, uh, I got in trouble. She, uh, she wants me out here picking up sticks and I should have been doing that, but I've been talking to you guys. So I'm gonna have to blame you guys for this, okay? I'm just trying to keep you guys satisfied. That's what she said. No, she didn't. She told me to pick up sticks. So I'm going to be doing that uh, since she uh, she's on the phone too, okay, people? Okay, so she, she's on her phone too. So I have an excuse. She's over there watching movies. What is wrong? What's wrong with people? This generation always have a phone in their hand. Okay, I gotta go. I got work to do. I got her. Uh, Got her new flowers for her uh, work desk since she's working from home. Got some flowers slash weeds. They look good. Hey, she doesn't like these green onions that I did uh, for that video for the, uh, the first uh, Corona survival series challenge i'm gonna put it in my mouth to see what she says Yeah, she wasn't she wasn't happy with it as usual but she's used to it that's why I gotta make her laugh every now and then to make up for the other crap hey I know she'll get a good chuckle out of it but I'm uh, I'm gonna tell her uh, when she's done like hey you cut the grass you catch all the fish you might as well ride the Loran lawn more and me pick up sticks and me be a house husband and wash clothes and cook uh, and she could work a, re a real job while I'm at home. So uh, she'll probably laugh about it, hopefully. I I I'll get her uh, interview later. Okay, I'll give you the mic. It wasn't, it was, it was Why? Why you got the head? It was pointing the other way. I don't want to walk too far. Walk but, where are we yeah, going? Yeah, I was just showing the good job she did. She did a great job. I, I told them that since uh, you got a real job, and you catch all the fish and you get to ride the mower like a man. You stupid. So I'm a house husband. That was my first time riding, doing it. Well, it's a nice job. Um, like I, I'm going to cut the, I need to get a weed eater, I guess, but I need to cut it with a regular push mower to get all the other stuff. But uh, I, I got everything else. Uh, I got all the yard, the sticks picked up finally after she yelled at me. The camera was off when she Ooh, screamed yeah, at did me. did you? The camera was off when she screamed at me. But, you uh, tell the lies on what's today? <laughs> Wednesday. Wednesday. <laughs> Wednesday lies. Okay. Pump day lies. Okay. Well, we're gonna we're gonna get inside and get this uh, get everything else squared away. Are you hungry? Yes. Okay. Well, we might go eat then. Okay. Well. You said go eat. Go eat. Yeah. Go. In we're the house. Go, eat. Oh, I when guess. you said go eat, oh, I thought you meant go. like go. The FedEx. She. I thought you had a DoorDash last night. I thought you, because you, you texted me, and I thought it was like a, a copy and paste to DoorDash, because I looked and said FedEx DoorDash, because I <laughs> joked with her and said I can be the FedEx DoorDash for everybody in FedEx. I so had if, to you're, place if, my you're watching, order. if you're watching and you work for FedEx, if you think that's a great idea, uh, it might be a premium charge, because it's chef type material. Yes, very <laughs> chef, elegant, uh, but uh, and prompt. I'm very very prompt yeah you did when i sent you my order you got right yep, on it yep uh cod cash on delivery why are we standing right here we can't move okay well you can move She's i hungry. got a mic on okay you got the no i was just you this? Is this yours? she got an anniversary present so i met her on the 13th that's the anniversary uh, cricket cage so she can creep crit creepy critters in fishing so i can keep creepy critters yep Hey, um, just got done, um, and we're got some we got some frozen pot pies heating up in the um, oven. I'm making some rice to go with it. 
Uh, had a productive day today. Had a really great day. Got a little little tan, as you can see. Uh, there you go. And I don't know what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. We didn't really plan anything. But we've been getting really good responses on... Um, on um, the comment section on the community news. So if you don't know where the community news is, it's at my homepage on YouTube. You hit community community news or community, and uh, the post will be there. So if you don't get notified, you can check it out every day or every other day. Um, people's uh, described, not people, but members of the disposal team, subscribers to the YouTube channel of mine, um, you guys have been answering comments um, about the questions. I wanted... I asked you questions, uh, well, I asked you for questions that you can um, uh, post in there for us to answer during our mukbangs or food reviews and stuff. So stuff about Tasha, stuff about me, um, and um, I will pick a number of them and talk about them on the food reviews and the mukbang. So uh, if you could do that, uh, that would be really nice to keep that rolling. I really appreciated it. So, um Thanks for watching another vlog, and talk to you soon. Go pro stop recording. Hey guys, I have hoodies in. The name brand are independent, so you know they are thick and high quality. I'm having them all the way from small to 3X, uh, only in black right now, so just go ahead and look in the descriptions for that. Uh, I do have uh, t-shirts as well. The name brand the t-shirts are canvas. Uh, they are thick, they are soft, the logo wipes off like a bib, just like on the hoodie. So if you want those, please check in descriptions. Uh, they all are pre-washed material, so they won't shrink on you. So check in descriptions for the price and the uh, shipping and handling of that, because I do ship in U.S. and in Canada. If you haven't already, um, hit follow on The Garbage Disposal on Facebook and follow me there to get more pictures and stuff. Uh, please subscribe to my page. Hit the notification bell to get notified of upcoming videos. And hit the like button if you like it. Other than that, please share it with your friends, family, and even your boss. Have a great day unless you made other plans.